Now that we know a little something about Pascal's triangle, I want to point out a couple of interesting things. But first, let's go to the computer and just remind ourselves where pa Pascal's triangle comes from. You can see Pascal's triangle comes from the expansion of the binomial x plus y to these different integer powers. And Pascal's triangle is simply the coefficients of all the terms. So you can see 1, 2, 1, 1, 3, 3, 1, so on and so forth. And that's what forms Pascal's triangle. And I've written the first part of it over here. 1, 1, 1, 1, 2, 1, 1, 3, 3, 1. This number comes from the sum of these two. We add these two to get this one, add these two to get this one, so on and so forth. Okay, here's a postage stamp I found that has a picture of Pascal on it. Postage stamp is issued in 1973 to commemorate the birth of Pascal in the year 1623. So then I also found this postage stamp, which has a, a picture of what looks like Pascal's triangle in Chinese from the year 1303. So let's go to the computer and take a look at um, Pascal's triangle in Chinese. Okay, here it is right here. Um, you can see it's written in Chinese, but it looks like Pascal's triangle. And if it is Pascal's triangle, this is the Chinese number for one. So one, 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 two, one, one, three, three, one, because we know it's Pascal's triangle. Now this row, one, four, this must be the number, right, six, because it comes from three plus three, which gives us six. Four, and then one, one more row, one, there's five little lines right here, so one, five, that must be the number 10, 10, five, one. So if you know Pascal's triangle and you see this postage stamp, it turns out that you can actually count in this Chinese number system. Now, when I teach this in my regular classroom, a lot of times I make it an extra credit problem for students to take that number system and count to 50 in it. Not all the numbers are there, but once you see how that number system is organized, it becomes pretty easy to count to 50 in that number system. So I have another question for you. Here's Pascal. He's born in the year 1623. We have this triangle named after him. Here's a postage stamp with the same tri triangle on it from the year 1303 way before Pascal was born. How can we name it Pascal's Triangle? 